What's going on other drivers today? I wanted to just do a quick video. I've noticed and I'm sure you have too that uh, fuel prices have started to go down which is obviously great news for us you know from six dollars a gallon to I'm I just filled up for uh, was it 326 a gallon so with my discount <clears throat> so that's pretty darn good but I've also noticed that uh, all of a sudden my fuel filters are getting full <clears throat> so I'm one of the few trucks uh, out here probably that still has a fuel filter gauge that allows me to check that because my last fuel filter if you guys remember the video from uh, the update on the truck <clears throat> maintenance wise I went like 30,000 miles on a surface which is not what I would normally do and uh, <clears throat> yeah, my, I think I'm at like 10,000 on this one and uh, my fuel filters are starting to get clogged up I didn't even know the gauge worked so that's uh that's how I noticed that so and here I'll show you the gauge real quick now it's not gonna show anything right now because the truck's not on but even with it on if it's not under load it's not really gonna show anything crazy <clears throat> Build up for a second here. But anyway, that gauge now, when I'm under load, goes up over the 10 mark. That's where it's been sitting all day. And if you can see the gauge, it goes up to 30. So once it gets into the red there at 10, I mean, it's, it's not like you're not getting fuel, but it's just something I've noticed is that all of a sudden now, that, that gauge is working and it has never read anything before when I do my service updates so now the last service was also done at a TA so is there a possibility that you know they have crappier filters very very possible but uh, I just wanted to reach out and see what anyone else has noticed if, if anything at all um, I'm just wondering if maybe fuel prices are getting a little bit better because they're using you know lower quality diesel fuel uh, or if this winter blend stuff is just bad for filters I mean I'm not really sure so <clears throat> let me know what you guys have seen and what you guys think maybe you know uh, I'm sure some of you out there know more about it than I do so yeah something I was noticing I wanted to bring attention to I've been putting the diesel treatment stuff in there now because that seems to help with uh, the fuel filter with the water uh, and removing the water and stuff this truck doesn't have a fuel water separator like some of the newer ones do so anyway i just wanted to put that out there for a thought see what anyone else was thinking or saw or noticed or maybe we're on to something here so all right guys stay safe see ya